What's good? It's Timeless Rod with TR Mentality, man. Before we get into the video, make sure y'all own your own shit. Now, before we go any further in this video, man, make sure you go ahead and leave a like on the video, comment, subscribe, and follow me on Instagram at Timeless Rock Music, and also share this video with anybody who can relate and need this information. In this clip, we got Joey Badass talking about never being satisfied with money and success. And he's absolutely right in this video, man. When it comes to happiness, man, if you connect your happiness and your main driver of happiness is success and money, and where you want to go in life you'll never be happy because like he said in this video man success is like a drug and growth is like a drug when you look at things as an artist when you want to get a million streams or you want to get a million dollars when you get that first fifty thousand dollars or you get the first fifty thousand streams you'll always be like well yeah i'm not where i'm not here i'm not there and even when you first get that million streams and million dollars by the time you get to that million dollars and that million streams you'll be plotting on 10 million streams and 10 million dollars and so you never really respected the growth or you never enjoyed the growth and at the end of the day, you'll never be happy because you're always going to be chasing that high. And we speak on this about songwriting all the time, man. Writing music is just like a high, man. You constantly want to make that next song that give you that dopamine rush where you just feel so good and it just feels like nobody could talk to you in any type of way. And I also spoke about this before, man. I remember when I first started off and like I said, I was using a $30 USB mic. I didn't have no speakers. I had some Beats headphones that I had for a long time and I had a laptop and that was all I had, man. I used to have to put the microphone on top of like a table and like three shoe boxes to make it so tall enough so that I could stand up when I record. And I remember at that time, although I was excited that I was able to record, I remember saying, man, I can't wait to have the top of the line studio equipment so that my sound could sound so professional and so crisp. And we all had those moments because obviously, you know, we all have goals. That's a natural thing to do. That's what we do. When we chasing a dream and we doing things that we want to do in life, we always going to have a goal, of course. But now that I got the equipment and the knowledge to make my music sound the way it sounds and the sound as crisp as I wanted to sound, I had to look back and I had to say, yo, I remember remember praying for better studio equipment and everything like that and when you in this music game and you constantly wanting to grow and like we said get those million streams and the million dollars and everything like that you're looking at the big goal and you're not really looking at the in-between so you're not really enjoying the in-between and you start to kind of look at it like well i didn't get my blessing yet because i want this but i had to look back and i had to say yo i'm living part of my blessing and i remember i went on instagram live make sure y'all follow me on instagram at thomas rock music so you don't miss no live but i remember going on instagram live and i just went on a long tangent about me just talking about everything just trying to open up other people's eyes and just trying to spread that same mentality just trying to let people know like yo start looking at what you're doing in life now versus 10 months ago six months ago type thing and you'll see that you really living in your blessing you living part of your blessing and everything that you've been praying for every single day is really coming true and it's unfolding before your eyes but if you go ahead and take a second to look at what's going on around you you'll really be able to understand that and you'll be able to really appreciate that man and you'll be more grateful every single day and you never want to rob yourself from joy man like we said when you living through your blessings and you really looking at the big goal you rob yourself from joy because every single day like we said you feel like well i'm not here and i don't you know i don't want to hear about all that other stuff wake me up when i'm here you know what i'm saying that's basically because you're on autopilot when you're going through the journey when you constantly just looking at the future and you're constantly looking back and all the type of stuff like that you got to learn to live in the present as much as possible man enjoy every moment i also heard somebody say man you know i feel like a lot of people live for memories more than moments because there's not too many feelings that's out there that's more strong than nostalgia so when you look back it's so easy to feel so good and you get this dopamine rush that make you feel like man that was a good time you know when you stuck in the future of looking at your goals and everything it gives you that dopamine rush stop robbing yourself from joy man start looking at the present man start enjoying everything you have start enjoying the road man start enjoying the journey because the journey beautiful once you reach those goals because we all gonna reach our goals you gonna wish that you was actually present for some of these moments man because you're gonna look back and you're gonna say damn that was pretty cool so hey man start enjoying every step of the journey and i promise you you're gonna be happy as hell during the journey but i'm gonna go ahead and leave y'all on that note man make sure you go ahead and leave a comment down below let me know your thoughts on the topic and also make sure you go ahead and leave a like on the video and if you're new to the channel go ahead and subscribe and i'm out of here man i ain't never getting too comfortable i got trust issues from the past that ain't never last i ain't gave up on love but i got a cold heart with a phone full of dogs but they ain't good enough i done tried to do the thought shit but that ain't for me baby i guess i like locks on wrist and i like flying around the world with a lady i could fuck right late night i can hit it right, I could fuck twice